Hi guys, uh, so um, we're in LA right now and uh, a few months ago, you know, Mike Chan, he was here and he said this place is supposed to be have the best hot pot in LA. So I didn't think we have time to uh, make it here, but you know, my wife friend Karen, she was like, yeah, you guys have to try this place. So we're here now to try the best hot pot in LA. So if you guys are ready, let's go. AKA, Buck. The best hot pot in LA. Before we go inside, let me show you guys something on the outside that caught my attention. You know how sometimes restaurants get really busy and they will offer you water while you wait? Well here at Hadi Lao, they have fruit tea or hot tea ready for you. So already, that's a plus for me. Alright, let's go inside. So right when you walk inside, if you look to your right, they have these instant hot pot for you to buy. So if you really like hot pot, you can have hot pot anywhere you want. And if you come here alone and you need a buddy to sit with, they have one ready for you too. So I'm definitely feeling this place. So here is the inside of the restaurant. It's noon on a Monday and it's this packed. I can't imagine how it would be like on a weekend. So this is our table. Very interesting decorations. I feel like I'm in a tree house or something. So here's the menu. Everything is on an iPad. Since this was our first time here, our friend Karen showed us what to order. It's not all you can eat, but she said you would definitely get full. We went with the boneless beef short rib combo and Karen highly recommend the spicy pork soup base. If you come here during lunch, when you order an entree, you get the broth and the noodle for free. Unless you order the dancing noodles. On another note, kids get to eat for free. They have a small tray with chicken nugget, fresh fruit, and a bun for the kid. So that's another plus. They have a sauce slash appetizer slash dessert bar. It's 99 cents extra per person, which is not bad at all. I want to show you what they have here and Karen will show you guys how she makes her sauce. So we have some red bean soup for dessert. Then we have some sesame sauce followed by some cilantro, green onions, Chinese chai flour. What? Fermented bean curl sauce, Thai chili, sesame oil, fried chili oil, ponzu, mushroom sauce, saute sauce, vinegar, minced garlic, crushed peanuts, homemade soy sauce, and preserved pickle. And up here we have the seaweed salad, mashed potatoes, peanuts, mandarin orange, grapes, tomatoes, honeydew, and mini bananas. And before you start eating, they provide you with a Ziploc bag for your phone and an apron so that you won't get any sauce on your clothes. Don't worry, your kid will get one too. Man, they are so thoughtful. So for $14.99, you get a plate of uh, vegetables. You got kale, cabbage, spinach, mushroom, carrot, tofu, and then you get a plate of meat and you get the noodles and the broth. So let's see how it tastes like. Since everybody get their own pot, you can control the temperature of the broth to your liking. Let's start off with the broth and see how it tastes like. Let me try the, uh, the broth. Very flavorful. Spicy. Sour. Delicious. And before we can continue, here come the dancing noodle shows.
Yeah. I have to admit, the broth is really good, so if the broth is good, everything else is good. And while we were eating, a server came by with some toy for the kid. It can't get any better than this. Or can it? We'll see. That's the noodle. It's pretty good. It tastes like a regular noodle, but it's thicker and wider and more chewier. They give you enough food so if you were to eat everything, you would definitely get full and don't waste anything. Another plus. And before we start with the dessert, look what I found in the restroom. Free toilet tree. Can't get any better than this. A bill came out to be $84.16 before tips and with tip was $99.53. And that is for four adults. And for dessert, I got some fresh fruit Sambola. It has longan, dates, and seaweed. And then of course, we have the red bean soup. And look, they give you free dessert. Mm. Pretty good, not too sweet. Well, red bean is pretty good. Honey do. Hang around with that. But yeah. Um, my friend Karen said if you come here doing lunch, free noodle and then uh, free um, soup. But you come, you know, do dinner, they will charge for that, five dollars, something like that. But anyways, um, definitely you can say this place is a pretty good hot pot for LA. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for staying to the end. Be sure to hit the subscribe button on your way out, and I'll see you soon. So when I was in Hawaii, I saw these bird of paradise flowers and I thought they were rare. And here in LA, they are everywhere. And Karen, if you're watching this, thank you so much for taking us here and congrats on numero dos.